WLRN Newsroom, I'm Kristen DiMatte. The city of Fort Lauderdale is honoring the memory of a black man who was lynched there nearly 100 years ago. Dozens of street signs will be posted along a two-mile stretch of road on Davie Boulevard. They will carry the name of Reuben Stacy. The South Florida Sun Sentinel reports that generations of Stacy's family gathered at an unveiling ceremony yesterday. In July 1935, a mob of white vigilantes hanged Stacy and shot him 17 times. This was days after a white woman accused him of attacking her. According to Stacy's family, he had merely stopped at her house to ask for a glass of water. Mayor Dean Trentalis said atonement was long overdue. He then apologized to the family on behalf of the city. Republican U.S. Congresswoman Maria Elvira Salazar of Miami has introduced new immigration legislation. It would set up a legal residency program for undocumented immigrants living in the United States, but only after satisfying certain requirements. WLRN's Sherry Lynn Cabrera has details. Under the Dignity Act, participants could get legal status by paying $10,000 in restitution over 10 years to the federal government. 